So the next stretch we're going to look at again is working on the hamstrings against a muscle that does get really, really short and really tight after cycling. So this time what we're going to do, instead of the drop into the floor using gravity, we're just going to bring our legs up using our bike, or again a fence or a gate or a railing, or even a partner can actually hold. Keeping your legs straight, you're already starting your stretch. Depending on your flexibility, you can start to bring yourself down. And what the aim is here is that you're actually bringing your head towards your foot. It's a misconception that you're going to try and get your head to your knee, because all you're doing then is sort of stretching and bending your back. But we want to focus on the hamstrings, so you're bringing your head towards your foot. Again, you want to be holding this stretch for 20 to 30 seconds. Okay, you might find a need to lift your leg off when you're finished. Just don't drag it off, or you might pull your bike over or your friend over. Lift up, close the next leg on, and exactly the same process again. Trying to get that head down towards the foot as opposed to the knee. Hold for 20 to 30 seconds, and again, just gently lift the leg off, and then you're done.